Hey, what's up, everybody? It's Josh here. I'm here with Coach Carey and Coach Tia. We're going to go over this week's Simple and Sinister Her workout for you. So for this workout, we're going to have five stations. We're going to have one exercise at each station. It's going to be 40 seconds of hard work, 20 seconds to rotate. We're going to go around the room four times. We'll have a finisher for you at the end. Now, 40 seconds is a good amount of time. So when we're working these, I want you to focus on your form. Give yourself that time to work those quality reps. You don't have to rush here. Every rep should be a good rep today. You ready, Coach? Okay, so station number one, we're going to start on the rowers here. We're going to think about power. Power, not speed. Every pull, keep those knees pushed apart. Deep breath in on the way in, nice flat back. Push that air out as you're pulling. One hard pull at a time here. Try to track your distance, and every time you come around, reset that screen. You want to try to meet or beat that distance you got in that first set. Nice job there, Coach. From there, we're coming over to station number three. Coming over to station number two with Coach T over here. She's on the suspension trains for her TRX4 lunges. We're going to want to make that the suspension train just a little bit shorter. But you're right, so we're in our tricep extensions here. Arms out straight overhead. T's got that moving plank position going here. Glutes are squeezed, hands rolled up. Just bending at her elbows like she's trying to touch the back of her neck with her hands. Deep breath in, push that air out as you press away. Back in almost like a Superman position here, but at that angle, if you need to, put one foot a little bit further forward. It's gonna lighten up a little bit. It's gonna help you make sure you get that full range of motion here. Stepping back to make it a little bit heavier. Nice job. From there, we're coming over to station number three. We have Coach Carey here, again, demonstrating our army crawls. So you're gonna get your feet set up on those sliders, wall up those abs, glutes are squeezed tight, grabbing with those hands and forearms here. Start with small range of motion, get intentional with those reps. You can get bigger as you feel more comfortable. This is a lot of work for those abs and that lower back. So stay controlled here. You can go back and forth here as well. You can also go to a slider crawl if that's gonna feel more comfortable here. Getting your hands set up on those sliders, driving through those legs here, pushing the ground away from you, pushing that space between your shoulder blades up toward the ceiling, going down and back here if you need to make that adjustment. You can also just hold that plank at any point if you need to. Nice job there, coach. From there, we're coming over to station number four. Coach T's back. She's on the dumbbells. She's gonna demonstrate our dumbbell pivot presses. So she's got two dumbbells starting at her shoulders here, and then she's gonna pivot through that back foot, squeeze that back loop, rotating through, punching that dumbbell up to the ceiling, using that pivot for momentum here. Deep breath in, push that air out as you're pivoting. Again, if you need to, slow down, take an extra breath between those reps. Make sure you're challenging yourself. You can always make those dumbbells lighter as you're getting tired here. Nice job. See and then from there, we're over to our last station. We have our Charleston step buzz. Coach Carey's back. She's gonna get one foot set up on that, on that box. She's gonna drive up with that other leg, pull that knee up toward her chest, and then stepping back with that left leg into that reverse lunge. So it steps up with the left leg, and then stepping back with the left leg here. If you need to, you can use that box for some balance. If the lunges are an issue for any reason, you can just go with those step ups here. Um, it's up to you how you want to work these, but we're going to get two sets in on each side. So you can do 40 seconds on one side. When you come back around, we're 40 seconds on the other. Or you can go five and five here and keep switching it up during that 40 seconds. Okay? That's our simple and sinister herb workout for this week. Great job, everybody.